Hello everyone, today I am back on Minecraft on another Minecraft map, and this one is called The Fourth Wall by Ghost Cat Production. So, so when I logged on, I found it a little laggy, not as bad as crack in the world, thank goodness. But, expect maybe a little lag. To so not enter with property. Rules and credits. Oh, what? Oh, I the buttons. Rules. Play in peaceful, set your game out to adventure. Just gonna make sure. I'll just wait. No, wrong one. Difficulty. Peaceful. Wait, no. Oops. I just read it wrong. I swear I didn't mean to. Wait, is it already? Oh, it's locked and easy. I don't know why they'd say anything else. Don't rage. It's dangerous. Don't listen to lies. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't read the book. Please do take time to glance through and appreciate the many people who helped make this map possible. So just take a look through all of this stuff. These are the people who made the map. And I guess those other people. Yeah, I'm not going to read all that. It'd take too long. I'm not going to go to the YouTuber's room. I feel like that would be a waste of time. Let's just start the map. Uh, oh no. Dr. Rachel. Okay, here's the rundown. We'll be going inside the virtual reality game Medieval. The characters in this game, since they are only fabricated by computers, have no idea that they aren't real. Your objective is to break that barrier and help the characters realize that they're in a game. Even getting one to break through the fourth wall would be a huge accomplishment. How should I go about doing that? Well, to be honest, we're not entirely sure. We have had a number of ideas, though, which we are, will relay to you via headset while you're in the game. Sounds fair enough, I guess. Will I be in any danger? No, it's all perfectly safe. This is the ol this is only virtual reality, so if you die in the game, you'll just respawn. What should I do if I manage to get a character to believe me? We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. I can tell this experiment has been totally planned out. Well, let's get to it. The folks at researching unique notions are ex oh, the folks here at researching unique notions are excited to see what will happen. I'll meet you down the hall. Head to the virtual reality machine. Oh, and everyone, really quickly, I'm getting a buzzing in my ear because of my headphones. This is normal for me because my headphones just have a weird glitch, so I'm gonna be dealing with it. If you can hear it. I feel bad for you. Uh, where's that room? No, no. Wait a minute. I just realized. They said cheeseburger. Can you, how about they do molecularized cheeseburgers? Oh my god, that guy's evil. He's eating the burger. So I guess I just walk up the staircase. Unless it's not here. In which case, I wouldn't know where it is. Okay, it is here. Dr. Rachel? Up here on the balcony to the right. Oh, there. Just push the red button when you're ready to start. Okay, then, here I go. Just push the big red button. That's how I can tell this is gonna go completely wrong. Because one of the objectives was push the big red button. Normally, you're not supposed to press the big red button. Also, I can see myself in F5 mode. If I see myself, I just mean see my armor. What's going on? Okay. I think I'm in the game. Well, I, yeah, I guess I am. Communication link stabilized. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Now, where do I start? Well, you might as well start by talking to someone, although I doubt you'll get very far with them. Play the game as normal, and we'll see how it goes. So, how do I play? You've never played Medieval before? No. Well that, should just, well, that should make things interesting. Head out to the center of town and talk to Jefferson first. Ooh, bread and apples. Ooh, I think I glitched the bread. Anything in here? No, I can't access. Um, 
I guess I just go talk to Jefferson. Wherever he may be. It said center of town. So... Wait, right? Yeah, center of town. Oh, here he is. Jefferson. Hey, glad to see you're up. I've been meaning to talk to you. Hi there. Actually, I've got something I need to talk to you about as well. Have you seen my lucky hat? I haven't seen it since I went fishing the other day. No, see, you're a fictional character in a virtual reality game. Ha, <laughs> what? You should say the funniest things sometimes. No, really, you're, a re you're not a real person. Someone imagined your entire life and then created you, but you don't really exist. Well, it'd be awfully hard to, t to be talking to you here if I didn't exist. My poor hat, though. I've just got to find it. Seriously, though? Hey. I almost forgot. Martha wants to talk to you in her booth back there by the church. Says evil powers are at work. She wants you to help. I told her you'd go talk to her. Actually, if you'd hear me out for a minute. Hey, I've got to get back to my train of thought. Let me know if you see my hat. Good grief. Good grief is right. How's it going in there? Um, could be better. Don't give up yet. We still have a few options to try. See if you can get Martha to respond first. Roger that. Okay. Oh good, you're here. Listen, some strange things have, happen have been happening lately, and I think you can figure out what's wrong. You're in a video game? I think the Wexford's family ghosts are restless. Terrence found something in the abandoned mansion and took it, and now he keeps mumbling nonsense. You're not real? <laughs> then I saw Helga and Hag run off with the object Terrence found. And now her cave is full of hideous monsters. She may be a witch, but I don't think she can summon creatures. Can you even hear what I'm saying? If you can retrieve that object and return it to the Wexford, the Wexford ghosts, maybe everything will go back to normal. Make sure you get a sword first, though. Why do I even bother? <laughs> Talk to Rachel, are you there? What's one of those other options you were talking about? Hold on, something's interfering with our signal. Dr. Rachel? Hello? That's just great. Wait, I, I just want to see something. Since he went fishing. They, they said this map, on, like, on the page, is, so it takes about two hours, maybe more, maybe less, depending on your skill level. I hope I'm not one of those people who takes more than the time that they state. What's this place? We in when the when the chunks don't load. I'm honestly not surprised by this. Okay. If I can just find out where he went fishing. Wait, did it say where he went fishing? Um Nope, doesn't say where, so... If I can't find an anything, then I might as well just try to do something else. Oh, hey! Person in a chest. Captain Barnaby. I can't talk to you. Nothing's in your chest. I'll just go to the library then. I I don't want to be wasting my time finding his hat. Well, I might look off camera for it, but you know, nothing. Yeah. Okay, there's that lag. I was wondering when it would come. Ooh, hey, I can access in this building now. I think. Unless there's already a door. Hello, do you want to build a rustic house with me? I can never die. Rustic houses are love. We must always make rustic houses. You will make more houses. Let's get started with the first step. Now is a good time to build a rustic house. I think I know who this is. So, because they're spamming rustic houses, and because I do watch one of the people that they mentioned on the page, if, 
So for those of you who read that page earlier in the credits book that I threw out, it said Green Yon. If you check my subscriptions box, you'll see that I'm subscribed to him. And for those of you who haven't seen his videos, there's somebody named NPC Grion who loves building rustic houses. Just all that explanation. Just for that one creepy room. <laughs> I, I honestly don't know what to say about that. Okay. The only question is, where's this library? In route. Dan TDM. Popular on my most. Okay, got hopelessly lost in a maze. Did parkour like Jen. Captain Parker's last word he heard. Jordan, you fool. Those people gave me slap the bike button to Sunday. Lost another bet. I have never heard of this guy, but he hugged a creeper. Uh, force fed peanut butter. Fused to build a rust. See? I knew it. Fused to build a rustic house with NPC Grayon. Spammed X33N with chickens. Went outside in winter wearing light clothes. Used F5 mode at the wrong time. Well, this graveyard's really, really weird. Uh, now the only question- wait. Okay, yeah, I was wondering where the library was. This would really simplify things. He wears a shirt of red. Huh? Watching. Always watching from behind the walls. He lives in that forsaken mansion. Um... I heard- I hear you found something there? She has it, but he acts as if she's no threat. Look, I'm supposed to find a sword. Do you have one? My poor books. Lost all over town, but never read. I must have all five back. <sighs> On my way. Okay. I doubt any of these books are, like, his lost books. If I know anything about video games, those light beams are showing me which building each book can be found in. I guess I might as well start here in the library. Okay, I guess logic kind of applies. Hmm. Ah! I don't know why that's... I get... One second. Video settings... Just gonna lower my chunks to 20. Let's hope Hero Brown doesn't scare me again because of lag. I actually feel a little bit pathetic because, you know, I was scared by Hero Brown, even though he literally just appeared. Um, hello, I'm sorry to disturb you, but. But is this turns his book in this conveniently placed chest here? Greg, Zzz. I guess I'll just be taking this then. Well, that was easy. Next beacon coordinates. Wait a minute. I have no idea if I have it or not. Oh, there's Greg. Not sure how I get to him. So, the next coordinates were 9,892. 9,000. Wait, so, this way. 9,892. 10,127. So, this one. Pastor Hampton. Welcome, welcome, how are you today? Well, I'm kind of stuck in a virtual reality game, but other than that, I'm fine, how about you? Well, to be honest, this one isn't one of my better days. Oh, this isn't one of my better days. One of the younger children tore up Sunday's school mural and have to put all the pieces back together again somehow. Well, that beacon light outside indicates that you have a book that I need. So, if I go to the overused, do this task, random stranger theme found in video games, I need to put your puzzle together in order to get the book. Video game? What are these strange words you use? Are you feeling alright? Never mind, where's the mural I need to put together? Just downstairs in the classroom. And another time-consuming quest begins. Question is, where is this- oh, there it is. Um... Um, okay.
So this is gonna be fun. Um, there's only one way to do this. Okay, I think this is in the bottom. Um, I feel like this would go here. Um, wait a minute. Hmm. Where was that other? Okay. This goes there. Okay, then I guess I have to move these ones up. Move this one up too. Okay, I'm doing good so far, I think. He wow. Okay. Nope. One over. Okay. Sheep should be maybe. Hmm. Let's add some more down. Nope. No. Hmm. No, doesn't fit there. There. This is definitely very time consuming. So I guess I technically wasn't even wrong. Maybe there. Okay. I think I'm doing this. Using my basic puzzle skills. Those of which I've acquired through a long and young life. Wait, no. I think that was right. No, it wasn't. Okay, just add a few more in for now. Wait a minute. Okay, that goes there. Not... Wait. Gosh darn it. I just realized now I have to move this over. They were right about time consuming. The only thing that would make this even more annoying is if they actually made it to where I would have to, um, you know, rotate it. And if the map creator watches this, if you wrote, if you make it the next one where you have to rotate it, I don't know what I'm gonna do to you. No. Wait, this goes here. This goes here, I think. Nope, goes here. That go wow, I didn't even mean to like put it there. I thought I was just guessing. Nope, goes down one more. This goes up here, I think. Okay, I've almost got this puzzle down. Okay, this definitely goes down there. This goes here. This, I, I would think, goes here. Yep, it does. This tree goes here. This goes here, and that goes there. I am being tricked. What? Am I trapped here or something? I'm so confused. Um, oh no. That was not me. Oh, sorry, totally forgot. Thanks for the reminder. What?
Um, well, this is scary. Long goes bobbleheads created by Bongo. Well, I'm officially scared. Um. Probably should have read those books. Um. Nothing here. Oh, I have to go in here. Restroom key. The only question is where are the restrooms? Wait. Probably in here. Yep. Kitchen key. Okay, now I can go in here. Hmm. Nothing I can access. Except for here. Nothing. There's nothing underneath. This is just great. Wait, what? Oh no. What? Why do I feel like this is some random glitch? All this because I didn't know what was going on. Why though? Who made this this way? Ha, huh? Uh, or hi, you must be Bongo. I don't want to be here. I have no idea what's going on. Wait, are you pointing to my head? What about it? Oh, it's gone. Um, th that's close enough. I don't want to be a bobblehead. Okay, here's the office key. What's this key? Exit key. Of course, why not? And that's the story about if Mutant Creeper became the next level will have a headed Mongo the Monkey's Collection. Far below the death's darkest chasm, Mutant Creeper suddenly realized that this whole thing could have been avoided either one of two ways. They could have avoided cheating in the first place, or they could have just used Slash Kill to get back to their last spawn point in the map. Oh my god. This is dumb. Okay, I still have my inventory. Okay, so... There. Okay, I see the last three beacons that I need to go to. So, that's a good thing. Okay, now, where's this book? Oh, hello, what can I do for you? 
Terrence wants me to return the books he lent out. Could you give me yours? I can definitely return that. Um, actually, I have such a headache, I can't think of where I left it. That new neighbor who calls himself NPC Grion is moving in just next door. He's building his own house from scratch. Could you run over and ask him to stop making so much noise? He works on that thing 24-7 and the banging keeps me awake at night. Sure, why not? I just love running random errands for fictional characters. I need to get a light. Oh no. Just looking at that objective scares me. Mainly because I know it might have to do with him asking me to help him build his rustic house. Oh. Well, I just did something very unnecessary. Hello, my name is NPC Green. Um, hi, Mary Ellen asked me to come talk to you. Would you like to build a rustic house? I would be happy to teach you how to build a rustic house. That's nice. Actually, I was going to ask you to stop working on your rustic house all the time. Now is always a good time to build rustic houses. Listen, could you maybe just tone down the noise a bit at night? Rustic houses are love. Step one is, click here if you want to build a rustic house. Why doesn't anyone ever listen to me? You must build a rustic house with me! Okay, I'm out. Nice chatting with you. I'm honestly not surprised that he, you know, tried to force me to build a rustic house with him. Okay, here's your book. Thanks so much. He did agree to stop working it at night, right? Right? Okay, I chose the right one that time. Let's see ya. So, that one. Okay. Whoops. Wrong button. Oh, oh, perfect. Somebody working just outside of the graveyard. This should be amazing. Gerald the Magnificent. Welcome, welcome. I offer me many fine wares for sale. Perhaps you'd be interested in these fine statues or, maybe, or these exotic potions? You seem like a practical person. Maybe a map would be more to your liking. No thanks, I'm just here to find Terrence's book. Do you have it? Oh, I suppose I could get that for you, but you need to do something for me first. <sighs> I really wish the people who made this game would have thought better of a better way to complete quests. You see, my uncle left me a treasure of great worth. Its value cannot be underestimated. It's buried out on the beach somewhere. He never told me where it was, however. Now take the shovel and go to the beach. Well, go on now. Chop, chop. We haven't got all day. Yay! Buried treasure now. This is just perfect, to be honest. It's just what I wanted to waste my time doing. <sighs> the worst part is, these are definitely the stupid quests that you get in video game. Farmer Fred. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so I can only dig up these kinds. I really wish I had an editing software for this stuff. That way I could do a little bit more in these. So now I'm just forced to... Oh! Uncle Jack's Marvelous Melon. Wait, I want to keep the spade. Gotta, gotta, gotta take this glass too, because why not? Perfect. Just throw these in there. And, and I really do have a problem with cheating and wanting to speed things up. Because I was just about to like go into creative mode or give myself speed. 
And then I remembered the bongos thing that just happened not less than five minutes ago. So, yeah, I do have a problem with cheating. Okay, next coordinates are the last one. This is good. I'll get this last book. And then I'll be finished with the with this dumb book collecting quest. The only thing I'm still wondering though is where was that guy fishing? Cause there doesn't seem to be like a good fishing spot except for the ocean. But there's like no piers or anything. So this house. Wheaton. Oh great, just what I need. Another customer. So I didn't have enough to do. Actually, I'm just here to get Terrence's book back. Eh, that old thing. It's back at my house. I could get it, but I'm too busy here. If you want, though, you can take over here for me for a while while I go get it. Uh, why does every video game rope the player into doing work? What can I do? Well, I just got someone to fix this place up. New gears, new machinery, the works. Trouble is, I don't know where anything is anymore. Someone in this build, somewhere in this building, are five stone buttons I have to press to get this place running, but I can't find them anywhere. I just need you to find and press all five. Good luck. I'll be back in a bit. This is just what I needed to do with lag. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. No, I can. Well, there's one. Okay, there's the another one. Wait a minute, let me go over here really quickly. Nothing? Hmm. Ow. Okay, I guess the rest are all up here, I think. So I've hit two buttons. Can't get in there. Mm. This is really bad lag. Oh, third one. to do these quests again. Even though this map's probably full of those quests. This lag is literally the worst. Wait, did he specify? Okay, yeah, stone. Oh, wow. Okay, I feel like the last one has to be up here. Mainly because I've checked everywhere else. Oops. Hmm. Nothing up here. Nope, can't do anything there. Where's this last button? 
That's all I want to know. Ow. Hmm. Oh, wow. Okay, here you go. Thanks for the help. <sighs> now, just gotta get to the library. Then, I didn't have to look for random things anymore. Wait a minute. Map of Wexford. Wait a minute. So... Okay, that, this is where the thing is. I have to go all the way north to where the mansion is. That's mu that must be where the hat is. Knowing logic and a map, it has to be there. Um... So... Where's the... So, I... Do I need the fifth book? Um... The only question is, where is this fifth book? Wait... I'm an idiot. I think... Okay, yeah, it was here. You know, I was wondering why Greg was right there, and why I was able to talk to him. To be honest, I thought he was on the roof. Terrence? 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 I have all five books. Hmm. Yeah, I'm at the library. Do I throw it at him? Wait. Maybe I put them in here. And talk to him. What? I am so confused. I there, there can't be, like, specific places for the book. That would be weird. Yeah, there's n there's no place where I can put the book. Terrence, come on. Here you go. Wait a minute. Um. I seriously have no idea what to do. Maybe, maybe this? I, I have no idea at this point. Well, everyone, I'm just gonna end it off there. Hopefully I can figure this out for the next episode of this. Because I have no idea what to do. I might go to that PR off camera soon if you have to see it. But I'll decide on that after. So, yeah, hope you all enjoyed. Feel free to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.